Okay, we're halfway through spring. The year is nearly done. But the question I have for you today is, can you get your head in the game this spring? The answer is, yes, you can. All right, so what are the couple of tips that I wanna share with you today? Number one, psychology is everything. Trying to take more action, make more calls to get more listings in this market today is actually worthless. What you've got to do is get this bit right, your mindset. A couple of tips that I'm going to share with you which will get that mindset really clear in trying to drive some really good outcomes and get the results you're looking for. So tip number one, I want you to think about, number one, what's the state you want to get into? We've just had the Olympics a couple of months ago, right? You think about Usain Bolt. He turned up to the Olympics was running for the gold medal. Do you really believe that he actually just strolled up and spoke to the guy next to him and goes, G'day, how was your weekend? And he goes, what country are you from? Or did he actually walk on there like a man possessed, ready to win the gold medal? Think about what he did. He had some, he had some headphones on, he was probably listening to some pump up music. He could have been listening to some affirmations that he recorded himself, who knows? But what he was actually doing is getting himself into the state. You see, if you want to execute better with your prospecting this spring, Think about like, you know, how are you gonna get yourself into that state? For me, when I was an agent, I used to go and grab a coffee. So, you know, I don't know if you watched the movie Glen Gary, Glen Ross. Great 80s film, some great, you know, actors in it, including Kevin Spacey. And I remember he, uh, one of the guys, Alec Baldwin, he said to one of the agents in there, he was going to get a coffee in the back in the sales meeting. And he said, stop right there, coffee's for closers. But you know what? That little bit in that movie resonated with me. So every time when I was going to go prospecting, I went out and bought myself a coffee because I went coffees for closers. Question you've got to ask yourself right now is what, how can you get yourself into a state? Is it pump up music? Is it listening to something motivational on a podcast? Is it watching something on YouTube that can get you fired up to make those phone calls so you can execute at your highest level? So that's number one. Number two is think about Usain Bolt again. He was closing his eyes as he was standing in that line and you could see him, he was going like this shaking his legs, moving his arms, but he had his eyes closed, listening to something. But here's the thing, he was visualizing the result. He could actually see himself winning gold medal before the race was actually even going forward. So here's the thing you've got to ask yourself. Visualize yourself thinking about like, you know, you're making a prospecting call and setting an appointment and setting a listing appointment or creating that sale. That's what you've got to do because think about that feeling that comes in. You go to a place of going, oh, I can high five someone, I can do something. So when you make that call, you're going to be at your highest level. The third thing you want to do is have lots of fun. As you make these calls, like think about having fun. Like just don't, you know, celebrate with every phone call that you make. Don't try and take it too serious. Sometimes prospecting, we take it too serious. We're too robotic. Have fun. The fourth thing I want you to think about is if you were calling a friend, how would you make that phone call? What would be your physiology? Like, you think about it, you'd be standing up, calling your mate, you'd have a smile on your face. You'd be making that call with so much different level of energy. So when you go and make these calls, think about maybe you've got your best friend on the other line. Rather than making this call that sounds so robotic and you're sort of so tense, and guess what? People are gonna feel it, right? Which means, leads me to the last point that I wanna make. Check in with your energy and vibration as you make these prospecting calls. If you're really gonna get your head in the game this spring, you've really gotta think about your energy and vibration. Could you think about me making a phone call going, you know, say to our cameraman here, hey Tom, um, I know you're thinking of selling, Would you, you wouldn't wanna list your home with me. I may not say that to him verbally, but it's certainly gonna come out non-verbally. So think about your energy and vibration. Check in with yourself before you do that. So guys, this is about crushing it between now and Christmas. If you really want to take your prospecting and level that up, think about getting yourself into a state of prospecting and getting your head in the game this spring.